Good morning, friends. This is Pastor Joe Palikathaya. I invite you to continue our meditation on building up the kingdom of heaven. How do we do that? Building up one another in the power and in the presence of Jesus Christ. How wonderful it is for us to believe that Jesus has chosen to come and live within us. As he is within us, let us allow or let us submit ourselves to him so that he may guide us in our ministry of building up others, all the people around us, for the kingdom of God. Today, as we are in the 43rd meditation, I invite you to meditate on Matthew chapter 5, verse 48. Jesus says, Be perfect, therefore, as your heavenly Father is perfect. Now, that seems to be extremely difficult for us. How can we be perfect? We are imperfect human beings. We struggle with a lot of issues. And often, we choose to follow the easy way that we want to be appreciated or honored by people. Therefore, we do not continue in our path of perfection. What can we do? I tell you, when I first read that scripture, I remember, is it not impossible for us to be perfect? How can we ever be perfect? The more I meditated on that, I discovered what Jesus meant. Jesus is telling us to look at your heavenly father. Your heavenly father is perfect. And look at him and follow him. And not only that, as we know, Jesus Christ, his perfect son, has chosen to come and live within us. He is here within us in order to encourage us, in order to train us, in order to inspire us to become perfect. The way we become perfect is making mistakes, repenting, and returning to God. That's our process of perfection. We want to be perfect. We want to be just like our Heavenly Father. You know, as little children, when we were growing up as little children, we wanted to be just like our earthly fathers how he behaved, how he thought, how he taught, how he walked, all those we wanted to imitate. And Jesus is telling us, do the same. Now, as adults, look at your Heavenly Father, how he is and how he does things. Therefore, become like him, wanting to do exactly as he has done and he continues to do. Who is our Heavenly Father? The scripture says, God is love. Yes, love is the perfect. In love God created us. In love God sustains us. In love God continues to lead us towards perfection. How wonderful it is to see Jesus Christ, the Son of God, if we focus our imagination and attention on him and learn to live as human being just like he lived, there we are fulfilling this instruction, this command to be perfect just like the Heavenly Father is perfect. Heavenly Father, we have no imagination. We cannot imagine or comprehend because God is above all of our imagination and comprehension. But Jesus, we can imagine, God became a human being. There is Jesus. And he became a human being to redeem us. As we follow Jesus, our goal must be to redeem the people around us. Sisters and brothers, throughout this day, let us ask Jesus to help us to be perfect, just like he was perfect. 
just like the Heavenly Father is perfect, to develop our relationship with God as we are His children, develop our relationship with Jesus as we are His brothers and sisters. Will you join me in this prayer? Let us pray. Eternal Father, we thank you, we praise you, we glorify you for creating us in your image out of your love. Lord Jesus Christ, we glorify you for becoming a human being and die on the cross for our salvation. Lord, continue to bless us to follow your example. Holy Spirit, inspire us to be perfect just like Jesus, just like our Heavenly Father. Keep our mind and heart focused on Jesus and our Eternal Father and follow them. We ask this blessing, Father, in the name of Jesus, your beloved Son, our Lord and Savior. Amen.